Psych2Go is a digital media organization that raises mental health awareness by presenting psychological topics in a digestible and relatable manner. Please share our content with those who need it. It's a great way to show your support to us as well. Today, we're covering an interesting topic that doesn't have to do with psychology, but we wanted to share about it just to see how many of you have had an experience with a twin flame. If you're interested in this topic, even though it may not have scientific grounds, but you want to learn more about it, watch on. In the words of Bob Marley, is this love that I'm feeling? Some say that when you experience it, you just know, and you can feel warmth stirring in your chest. Sometimes, however, when you finally think that you found the perfect partner, it seems like it's too good to be true. We might even feel the need to pinch ourselves just to make sure we're not dreaming. But plenty of people out there do find their twin flame, eventually. And these are the signs to look for. One, knowing the difference between a twin flame and a soulmate. Soulmates and twin flames are actually two completely different things, and it's important to know the differences. Soulmates might be perfect matches, but twin flames are our complete mirrors. In other words, they complete us in a much more real sense compared to soulmates. Opposites attract, after all. There are other halves, and these relationships are usually roller coasters of emotion. Where you might be patient, your twin flame may get antsy. And where you're more to yourself, your twin flame may be very social. Two, they complete you. Do you feel that your partner brings out the best in you? Do you feel most fulfilled when you're around them? If you only feel like you're whole when you're with your partner, there's a good chance that it's your twin flame. According to an ancient Greek story by Plato, people originally had four legs and arms, plus a head with two faces. At some point, these early humans were separated into two halves. This interesting fictional story perfectly illustrates what twin flames are all about. They're your long lost other halves. Three. You feel like you've known them your whole life. Meeting your twin flame for the first time can be a strange yet familiar experience. Some lovers even have a feeling of deja vu, as if the encounter had happened before. Maybe you've met your twin flame before in a past life. Whatever the reason, twin flames feel like they've known each other for their entire lives, even when they meet for the first time. Four, you know each other better than anyone else. While soulmates are sometimes referred to as part of your spiritual family, twin flames hold even more meaning. You know each other on an extremely deep level, more so than any of your family members or close friends. For twin flames, they're the only people in the world who completely understand one another. Five, you learn together. Twin flames are completely intrigued by each other, and not just because of physical or romantic attraction. With each passing day you spend with your twin flame, you learn something completely new, and these lessons help you grow as a person, more so than you ever thought possible. And this is one of the many things which keep twin flames so magnetically attracted. Since the experiences are shared with someone important to you, they hold that much more value. Six, you don't hold back your emotions when you're together. When you're with your twin flame, you feel completely vulnerable. There's no point in putting up walls or pretending to be someone you're not. Your twin flame sees right through this facade, so the only choice is to completely surrender to your emotions and to each other. But this isn't a negative thing, as twin flames find themselves craving this sense of comfortability. Seven, they help you confront your fears. Twin flames are inseparably in love, partly because they help each other conquer their fears. As nice as this sounds, it's not necessarily a pleasant process. However, it's a much needed experience to grow. Twin flames force each other to stare deep into the dark, scary abyss of their own souls. This drags many intense and painful emotions to the surface that are difficult, but are needed to mature. Eight, it's anything but boring. If you find your twin flame, you're in for one hell of a ride. Be prepared for a lot of ups and downs as your twin flame forces you to confront the most intense emotions you'll ever feel in your entire life. Being with your twin flame isn't necessarily fun. You might argue, break up, and cry endless tears together. Twin flames have an intensely and insanely strong impact on each other's lives. We're talking deep impact. 
like an asteroid slamming into Earth. Nine, you'll always forgive each other unconditionally. Even though you might get into extremely passionate arguments with your twin flame, you'll always find yourself forgiving them unconditionally. Try as you might, it's impossible to completely shut them out of your lives. And because you know each other so well, you ultimately understand why certain decisions were made, even if they caused you pain. However, as a life partner, they should be willing to recognize that they hurt you and work with you to make sure it doesn't happen consistently. And 10. Sometimes it's not meant to be. This is the hardest thing to accept about finding your twin flame. Although you are meant to be together, there's still no guarantee it'll work out. You might not be ready for a relationship this intense, or maybe it's just the wrong time for both of you. Either way, sometimes you just have to let your twin flame go, as painful as it might seem. You might have another chance in some distant future, even if you have to wait for the next life. What do you think about twin flames? Do you think they're real, or is this just spiritual nonsense? Have you found yours? Also, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. As always, thanks for watching.